Hey, what's up, YouTube? Thanks for joining me here at Paid to Trade. Uh, so today I'm going to share some terrible news with you. Not excited about it, uh, but, you know, there is a silver lining. Uh, but either way, if you're a fan of transparency, uh, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe. Um, and thanks again for tuning in. So if you're looking at the same screen I am, uh, as you can see here, uh, I only have a few accounts left. Um, I was on vacation and I've been doing really well uh, with my trades. Like every day has been just going so well. And I feel like I've just been killing it in the market. Um, my accuracy has been way up, you know, and I've been sticking to my rules. I've been journaling. Like, so everything that I've been talking about in the videos, I do that. Um, but while I was on vacation, I was not sure if I should be trading or not, you know, and I, you know, in hindsight, I should not have been trading um, or yeah, I just, I shouldn't have been. Anyways, I did take some trades. Uh, so a couple days in, I was fine. Um, and I was keeping it really small. And then the third day in, it was late at night. We had um, an early uh, day, you know, we were going to kick off the day like super early. Um, and I was thinking, well, let me get some night trading in, which I've done in the past and it's been okay. Um, and, but I was just not in my right mind. Uh, I wasn't well rested, you know, and I was forcing trades. You know, I took a couple trades. They were okay. You know, so I had locked in like, let's say 250 bucks in each account. It was fine. Uh, and then uh, I, I don't know what got into me and I just broke all my rules. And at that point I wasn't even journaling. I wasn't typically I'd, I journal after each trade, you know, I'd, put things down and, you know, it gives me time to kind of just gather my thoughts and to realize where I'm actually sitting at, you know, profit wise. And it just lets the reality kind of set in and that's helpful to me. Um, and then also just obeying my rules, knowing that I want to stick within just a few trades. You know, I want to make sure I'm only trading so many contracts You know, I usually keep it really tight. I keep it, you know, really small, about two contracts, uh, sometimes a few, uh, in most of the accounts. Um, but anyhow, I, uh, I ended up oversizing and I wanted to just tack on a bunch more. And I was sitting so high in profit, um, like overall in my accounts. And I can't even tell you what happened. The trade went very wrong and then I spiraled. And so basically in the end, uh, I lost like over a million funding. Um, so that was a really bad night for me. Um, and not a feel good being on vacation, you know, but, um, you know, I got over it, still try to enjoy the vacation, but now, you know, that I've been back, I've had, you know, a week to kind of regroup and, you know, I had some, I had these, have these accounts here that are ready to go. I always have some kind of in the, in the background, just in case, you know, um, but uh, yeah, I'm, I'm starting fresh. So I have to start fresh. Um, and it's like, man, it's a humbling experience, but, um, you know, I'm going to do it and, and I did it before. I'll just have to do it again. Um, so, you know, that's, that's it. That's everything in full transparency. I'm starting brand new. Uh, so it is what it is, you know, but it goes to show like stick to your rules, um, you know, journal, you know, just be real with yourself and don't over trade, don't oversize, um, because that, that was my downfall and, um, you know, trade while being well rested, you know, um, and just be in the market, trade the setups that, you know, make sense. Uh, don't force trades. Um, so it is what it is, but yeah, starting over. So if, uh, if there are any of you that would like to start with me, uh, I'm going to go ahead and kick this off uh, Monday, start Monday. I'm going to grab some new accounts and then, um, we'll put these into the seventh day. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll start fresh with some new accounts because we got to get them back up there. So I want to roll with, uh, with 10 total. So, um, I'm going to add seven more this weekend. Um, so then Tuesday come Tuesday, I'll have three PAs, you know, back up and running. we got to get those, um, you know, paid out. And so we'll have a couple weeks to do that. So that'll be plenty of time. Uh, and then we'll have the other seven up and running. And then uh, as we get those near completion, then we'll probably tack on another five or 10 uh, so we can get back up to 20. 
Um, so that is the plan. But um, if you guys want me to go live, I've been thinking about going live. Uh, tell me if you're at all interested in watching that. If it's something you'd like, uh, you know, leave me some comments, drop me some feedback. Um, but definitely hit that like and subscribe. I appreciate that. And uh, if you're not already signed up with uh, with Apex Trader Funding and you've been thinking about it and you want to kind of join me in this new journey, having to start fresh, uh, I got some links in the description. Go ahead and click on those. I'd appreciate that. It helps support the channel. Um, and then you can join me on this journey as I start over again. Um, but uh, I think this time is going to be different. So I'd like to see what you guys think. Uh, I'd like to have some company in this journey. And I think we can get to uh, where we're all trying to get to uh, together. So thanks again for tuning in. Uh, you guys have a great weekend. And uh, I'll see you next week.